upset Moaning Myrtle. He mean more than usual. I could hear her wailing all the way from the grand staircase. And the court outside her bathroom is flooded again. You don't think someone else has been attacked, do you? Anything could have happened. Come on, let's go see what's up. It would be easier to reassure our younger students about the air if, if I wasn't scared silly myself. Hello, Harry. Hello, Harry. Last week, I charmed a deck of cards to keep track of the house points from each of the four houses. something at you? Yes, they did. It's over there. Careful! My dad told me some books can be very dangerous. It looks like an old diary. Belonged to T.M. Riddle. Whoever he was, he didn't write in it. It's completely blank. Hello, Harry Potter. My name is Tom Riddle. I'm at Hogwarts and horrible stuff's been happening. Do you know about the Chamber of Secrets? Of course I know about the Chamber of Secrets. In my fifth year, the chamber was opened and the monster killed a girl. I caught the person who'd opened the chamber and he was expelled. I can show you, if you like. I can take you inside my memory of the light of the court. Harry was entranced by the memory Tom Riddle showed him. Come on! Gotta get you out of here! Come on now! In the box! It's alright! Come on out! There you go! Evening, Rubeus! What are you doing down here, Tom? It's all over. I don't think you meant to kill anyone, but monsters don't make good pets. It never killed no one! Come on! The least Hogwarts can do is make sure the thing that killed that girl is slaughtered. It wasn't him! He wouldn't! He never! Stand aside. No! Harry had always known that Hagrid had an unfortunate liking for large, monstrous creatures. But he was equally certain that Hagrid would never mean to kill anybody. Riddle might have got the wrong person. Maybe some other monster was attacking people. How many monsters to think this place can hold? We always knew Hagrid was expelled. And the attacks must have stopped then. Otherwise, Riddle wouldn't have got his award. Riddle's diary! It's gone! What? But only a Gryffindor could have stolen it. Nobody else knows our password. Exactly. The voice! I just heard it again. Didn't you? I didn't hear anything. Harry! I think I've just understood something. I've got to go to the library. But McGonagall said we have to stay in here unless we're in class. And I've got to talk to Hagrid. If he set the monster loose last time, he knows how to get inside the Chamber of Secrets. Hagrid's hut is out in the grounds, Harry. But you know that. Follow me, Harry.
someone who looks very much like Lucius Malfoy coming into Hagrid's heart. Bad business, Hagrid. A very bad business indeed. Things have gone far enough. As chairman of the school governors, I've simply got to act and send you away. Away? Away to where? Not the wizard prison. Not Azkaban. I'm afraid so. A dreadful thing, Dumbledore. But all twelve of the governors feel it's time for you to step aside. As of this moment, you are suspended as headmaster of Hogwarts. If the governors want my removal, Lucius, I shall, of course, step aside. No! However, you will find that I will only truly have left this school when none here are loyal to me. You will also find that help will always be given at Hogwarts to those who ask for it. Of course, if anyone wanted to find out some stuff, all they'd have to do would be to follow the spiders. That'd lead them, right? That's the key to the whole thing. And that's all I'm saying. Come along now, Hagrid. All right, I'm coming. We're in trouble now. Oh, Dumbledore. There'll be an attack a day with him gone. Look, over there. Looks like they're heading for the Forbidden Forest. to climb. I'll give you a leg up, Harry. You'd have to brave the Forbidden Forest alone. <laughs> 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 